Well, I think the, the way the United States phrased it, saying uh, it, that we, or uh, the United States, did not uh, take any position on the merits uh, of the case, um, but rather supported the process uh, that was uh, undertaken. Uh, under the uh, UN Law of the Sea Convention, um, China is a signatory uh, to that, uh, and the process has uh, been set up uh, that the United States agrees with. Ironically, we have uh, signed the treaty. We have not ratified it. And frankly, I believe uh, it is a mistake for us not to have ratified it, and I hope we will in the future. But we nonetheless abide by it and abide by its provisions and, be and believe we are bound by it. And so the uh, issue for me uh, it was not as, quote, sweeping uh, as has been declared by some. And I think we have to be careful of the rhetoric that has been used. Uh, I've seen headlines that say that uh, China uh, has been humiliated. Uh, it hasn't been humiliated. This is an illegal issue which has been decided. And what the uh, tribunal basically was saying is that, and I believe to be the case, that China has legitimate, legal, uh, maritime issues uh, that need uh, to be resolved. They should be resolved according to international law, and that it cannot simply declare this is mine and, uh, and that become the law as such. So either altering facts on the ground or uh, in the water do not change the law itself. So I think that um, we should step back and not get uh, overly uh, passionate about it, uh, and uh, accept it for what it is, that China has legitimate claims, Philippines have claims, other countries have claims. They need to be resolved according to uh, established international law. And my hope is uh, that let some time uh, pass. Uh, I think to date the Chinese have acted uh, with uh, restraint, and I'm hoping that will continue. And I don't want to see the Philippines or the United States in any way try to uh, take advantage by belittling uh, China in any way. What we're saying is there are rules uh, that should be followed. There are legal claims uh, that China uh, has and a maritime expertise that it has that needs to be uh, laid out in a professional, legalistic way um, before uh, a, a body that is entitled to make judgments. That's what I think the uh, decision really represents. And you, you, you talked about um, U.S. belittling China in South China Sea issues. Um, some arguments had it that it was the U.S. Um, pursuing this lawsuit uh, with the Philippines as a surrogate. I know that was the case uh, in terms of those who are asserting that. I have no basis to believe that at all. I think what the United States position has been, we want to see these issues resolved peacefully. Uh, and not through the use of force by any party. Uh, and frankly, after the decision, I, I thought it was encouraging to see the president, the new president of the Philippines, say that he wanted to sit down and start uh, discussing it with China, which is really the way it should be resolved in terms of, um, of, of negotiating a proper settlement.